Welcome back. In a big development, India has announced its first significant discovery of reserves of lithium, a rare mineral crucial for manufacturing of electric vehicles. The Geological Survey of India found the lithium reserves in the Salal Hairmana area of Raisi district in Jammu and Kashmir. The discovery is up to 5.9 million tons. So far, India had depended on Australia and Argentina for lithium imports. Now, remember, lithium is a key component in rechargeable batteries that power numerous gadgets like smartphones and laptops, as well as electric cars. Experts say that the discovery could aid India's push to increase the number of electric vehicles in the country, especially cars, by 30 percent by 2030, as part of the efforts to cut carbon emissions. A little bit more of what has been found: 5.9 million tons lithium reserves found in Jammu and Kashmir, so in the Salal Haiman area of the Raisi district. Previously, a small reserve was found in Karnataka, but that reserve was as little as 1,600 tons that were discovered in Mandya. Globally, lithium reserves concentrated are concentrated in South America. Argentina, Bolivia, and Chile have 50% of the global deposits. But, and this is where it's very interesting for India and the world, China controls 75% of lithium refining. Let's tell you a little bit more about lithium itself. It's the lightest metal on earth, therefore very, very important. It has the lowest density of all metals, two times lower than that of water. It forms only 0.0007% of the earth's crust spread across the globe, so it's very rare. It is extracted from either brines or mined rock sand. It looks like a shiny metal that can actually be cut with a knife. Lithium is consumed mostly by battery makers as hydroxide or carbonate, but the uses vary from electric vehicles, mobile phones, laptops, cameras, even clocks and toys. Now, lithium was discovered in 1817 and since then, the demand for this rare earth element has skyrocketed so much so that it is today called white gold for the auto sector. And this is why each e-vehicle requires over 30 kilograms of lithium chemicals. 56, over 56% of the global lithium though is used in batteries which run almost everything nowadays. By 2023, the demand for lithium is predicted to rise by 400%. Currently, about 85,000 to 100,000 is produced annually, is produced for use annually. And the production of this soft solid metal has increased by over 300% just between 2008 to 2018. Let's take a look at which countries have the biggest lithium reserves in the world. Now, as I mentioned, over 50% is found in what is called the Lithium Triangle of South America. One third of the reserves in the triangle are in Bolivia, close to 27 million tons. Argentina has the world's second largest at 17 million. Chile comes third at 9 million. And then it is followed by countries like US, Australia and China. The Indian discovery puts it at one of the biggest reserves that any country has now. So that's the kind of edge it is giving India globally. There are though also massive ecological concerns when it comes to lithium generation. Lithium mining uses gallons of water and pollutes water resources. It increases carbon dioxide emissions, it depletes fertile land. It causes respiratory problems and produces massive mining waste. It is quite likely that more advanced and greener technologies like hydrogen will be adopted sooner and take over, for example, EV demand in the future. But as it stands, the reserve find in India is definitely going to keep it in good stead. With that, it's a wrap on Plain Speak. Thanks a lot for watching.